Welcome, this is Zahn with Repo Products. Today's Revit Tips and Tricks is tip number five and six. You can use the keyboard shortcut command SZ to close a polyline, if you will, when you're creating objects. And the other is how to input formulas in the top and bottom offsets of objects. If I head over to level one and I want to create, say, a polyline of walls, say another building over here using this wall type. As I draw the walls and I want to get to that last segment and I want to close this portion, I can type in SZ and it will actually close it. If you click out in space, the command will finish and you don't have to worry about clicking to that point. The reason this keyboard shortcut is valuable is because if you're drawing something very large and your position of the end point on the wall is such that it's off the screen, like this, as I type in SZ, it closes to the end and I can just click. I don't have to pan over and then click at the end to close that. The second uh, tooltip is if you select an object such as a wall, you'll notice that there is a base offset and a top offset located here. You can either just input a value for the top offset, say two feet, and it increases in height. If we look at this in 3D, you can see that height. However, instead of putting in a number, you can actually put in a formula. For example, uh, five feet, uh, minus two feet and hit enter and it'll ask you to input the formula starting with an equal so put in here equals five feet dash two uh, minus two feet hit enter and it actually gives you that formula value and then that value will be calculated and the information will adjust the object and that's the uh, Revit tool tips for tip number five and tip number six.